So I just finished recording the last episode and I'm like, I want to play more. So <laughs> that's, what, that's what I'm doing. Uh, what I want to do at the moment is finish off this initial um, series. So the first five rounds, the first five races, and then we'll see what happens um, after that. I think that's the plan. Um, I don't want to like go into like a, yeah, I, I, want, I want to be careful. I don't want to say like, this is going to be a full series. I'm not going to lie to you guys, um, but I read the game. I want to keep playing for a little bit. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I think we're ready for the next race. I done all like the pre stuff. Invitational, what's that? That's intriguing. Okay. So I'm going to push it again. Um, second or above. I reckon we can do it. I hope. <laughs> I really hope. Uh, or fourth. Full four above is pretty. I'm going to fall for above. I'm going to play it safe. Just in case something goes wrong. It looks like this track is incredibly aggressive on the tyres. You saw the options there, it was like medium, hard, it was, yeah. So I guess it's a hot track. Maybe certain corners are a little bit aggressive, I don't know. Um, continue. The top two drivers, Wes McKenna and Eduardo Melo, are set to resume hostilities. Yes, the pole position shootout is about to go down right away. Yeah. All for above. I think that's more doable. Because stuff can happen. Mistakes can happen. Uh, first time to drive. This will be our first race for our new driver as well. Uh, we're going to go for... This is risky. Um, let's go for this one first. Change blankets. Change the temperature. So we use six spanners there. Uh, let's try and go for... Uh, try again. I gotta give it a go. Four spanners. We'll leave it there. Yeah, I think that's perfect. So the medium is the softest compound of the Grand Prix, which is kind of crazy. So I'll send him out. Stanley Bart Stanley. Bit of a weird name, um, not gonna lie. But look, look at that dude. Look at those glasses, the aviators, the hair, the moustache. What a cool dude. I love him. Uh, let's go for a 13% bonus. Made it slightly more stiffer. Oh, that was close. That could have almost failed. Mediums again. Uh, send him out. He's going out as well. Just behind McKenna. Let's see what our drivers can do. We'll put it into fast forward mode. I want to try and get two races done today. It might be quite a long episode. But it's I think this game suits long episodes. More of a sort of chilled out uh, vibe. Let's see what happens. Uh, can Stanley impress me? He's a very young driver. Can I with the fastest lap? All purple sectors. And Stanley's in second place. Not bad. Not bad at all. Both drivers are coming back. Uh, we can send them out again in a second. Send them out straight away. Do another lap. Continue. Uh, let's take a risk. 24% bonus if this works out. Adjust the toe in. Still got eight left. Let's risk it. I'm risking it. Changing the te Ooh! Three spanners left. So, roughly got a 0 0.5 second increase on time. So, that's enough, I think. Medium tires again. And send you out. Send out Stanley. Try and prove the car again. Uh, between 0 and 15. That's a bit risky. Don't fancy that. Optimize the length of the gears. Try that one again. Um, yeah, give it one more go. That's all. <laughs> Just the right amount. It's going well. Right, let's fast forward it again. See how we do. Kenna. Can he deliver? So Stanley now is in third place. Damn. Damn it. Stanley, you got to step up. Green sector. Purple sector for McKenna. He's beating his own time. Green search again for Stanley. Wow. First and second again. Stanley's a little bit behind. I'm hoping there's time for another another lap. Fingers crossed. So I've paused it. Let's try and do some more work to this car. Let's take a risk. Let's go for it. Use illegal parts. Oh, disaster. That didn't work. Ah, it was a risk, but... I right, let's give it a go. 
Stanley's got to try and hold on to second place or even improve. I'm not going to complain if he does. Adjust the tire pressures. Disaster again. Great. I don't think they're going to improve on their times, but we'll see. We'll see. Going out on new tires again. This will be their third lap. I think they've got time to go around here to begin that qualifying lap. Uh, both slower sectors. Nah, this ain't gonna work. Oh, green sector for Stanley. Uh, so he's third. Has he? Was that, was that an improvement? I think it was. So Stanley's gonna be starting in third place. I was hoping for slightly better. New achievement. But yes, third's okay, isn't it? For his first race, he's only 17 years old. Loads of potential. So, uh, yeah. Uh, we've got the bonus. The objective from the sponsor. I'm going to try and make this a little bit quicker. So we're going to use the fast forward button a little bit more. Because, yeah. Is that clouds I see? That looks like clouds. Definitely looks like clouds. And here is the starting grid. There's Bart. Yeah, he just about slots into this uh, this tier. But he's got room for improvement. So, and he's very, very young. I think he's a good addition. Right, let's begin the race. Do we start on the mediums? I reckon so, yeah. Um, both going to be fairly aggressive at the start. I tend to do this because obviously the start, everyone is fired up. They want to try and make some positions. We're all going to... not. We can't include that because the super softs aren't actually in this race. So that kind of sucks. Fine. Uh, that's all good. Yep, yeah, we're ready. Let the race begin. I'll start it quite slow at the start. Um, once we get to the... Someone's got the, the harder compound and the super hards as well at the back of the grid. Most are starting on mediums. McKenna is still in first place. Great start. Looks like Stanley. Oh, he's fighting for second place. He's got second place. Very good. Let's bring down the tyre wheel already. Down to neutral. And make sure the fuel... Obviously, there's no refueling, so we've got to manage that fuel. We're going to our first and second. Stanley wants first place. He wants to prove himself. Looks like Stanley's tire wear is very bad. Very bad. 84% already. That is a worry. That is a worry indeed. I'm not going to lie. Uh, so the condition of the car is 42% already. We need to get an engineer which works on reliability. That is going to be very, very important. Kenna with the fastest lap. Kenna is quick, like, very, very quick. Looks like Stanley might be struggling to hold on to that second place. Uh, lap feels quite critical at the moment, so I can't really change that. Tire wear is also pretty critical. Stanley will be pitting first, I can confirm. Um, I don't imagine there's going to be any rain. No, no chance. No chance. When do we bring Stanley in? I reckon just not this lap, perhaps the next lap. He's got to have a really good in lap. Alright, so you can. Has he gone past the pits? Yes. I hope. <laughs> um, let's pit him. So I'm going to put you. What do we do here? Super hards? I mean, he is absolutely ruining those tyres. Also, looks like the condition of the car is an issue as well. We're going to go for... So, how many laps are left? Around 11... 10 laps left. It's got to, it's got to be super hard. This could be interesting. Um, don't fix the car and pit. So, he's going to come in. Let's see how this plays out. Quite excited. He's got a five-second lead between... They're in the same car. He just lost... Wow, down to fourth. The tyres just gave up at the end there. Kind of sucks. Right, so he's now out in 18th place. Obviously, he has pitted. I'm going to pause it briefly here because I'm going a little bit too quick. Um, we need to bring in McKenna because these tyres are also worn out. We're going to go for the hards for McKenna. Yep, yeah, car is looking in pretty good state. Yeah, 44% is pretty good. Still half the race to go. 
reckon is going to come in on this lap. So, I'm going to make you push on those tyres. Need to conserve your tyres. Actually, neutral's fine for now. He's, he's ruining those super hearts. I don't know what he's up to, but it's crazy. McKenna, speed off into the distance. This is going to be an important pit stop. Can McKenna be coming in as well? Right, we've got to get out quick. Got to get out. Hoping that's good enough. Fingers crossed. He's going to come out in fourth place. Where is Stanley? Stanley, Stanley, Stanley. Condition of the car is an issue. Still got eight, eight laps left. Ooh. That's slightly worrying. I'm not going to lie. Hmm. That is a worry. Stanley is struggling. That car needs to be more reliable. It's just not reliable enough. Really not. So I put it down to conserve mode. So that shouldn't ruin the engine too much. Stanley is now in 11th place, up to 9th. I'd say at least three or four people have to pit in front of him. So he might make some positions up yet. He's had a hard, hard race so far. Can the car not break before the end? Looks like McKenna's going to take the lead. Very nice. Well done. 81% of his tyres left. That should hopefully be enough. Fingers crossed. Uh, I'm right about the fuel. He can conserve some fuel for now. Let's fast forward a little bit. So I'm worried about the fuel, so I don't want to... I don't want to run out of fuel. Dilemma! Uh, there's quite a bit of fuel spare. That is true. But the engine is broke, so... Uh, no. Confirm you stay in that mode. The car is broken. Excessive fuel, so that means we're now overweight. Stanley is struggling on those tyres. This has been a bad race for Stanley. Um, the car just isn't reliable enough, and he just wrecked the tyre wear. So, yeah. McKenna's got a six second lead. The lead slowly dropping. A, he's, he's keeping it around six seconds, so that's good. Oh, looks like condition of Lee McKenna's car is also an issue. Lovely. Uh, what, what's the issue here? Uh, there's something off about the gear shifts. Might be worth checking out. You might be right, but at the moment, we can't do that. We just can't. Um, right, Stanley, I'm going to let you push. This is a big risk. This is a massive risk. I'm going to let him push and see if he can gain some places. He's had a really bad race, though. He was right behind... The leader of the race by five seconds. He's now 35 seconds behind McKenna. He's had a really bad race. Very, very bad race indeed. Let's fast forward it. Last lap. Hopefully Stay does not break his car. He's now pushing though. I mean, he's pretty... He's not going to gain any positions, is he? No. I'm not going to happen. Ninth place for Stanley. Not good enough. I'm afraid. Not good enough. Oh, Stanley. Stanley, Stanley, Stanley. He just wrecked the tyre wear. We do need to improve reliability, though. So I need to hire a new engineer. Because the parts at the moment have a great performance, but they don't have particularly great reliability. So we're going to work on that. Uh, not now. I <laughs> do not want to rate your app right now. Sorry. That was a bit of a quicker race, I think. Fast forwarding. Uh, so... Where's McKenna? Got 25 points. I believe if we want to get promoted to the next tier, we need to win the Constructors. So, yeah. 109 points. That should be... We should be alright. Hopefully. If McKenna keeps delivering. Uh, McKenna's got quite a good lead, though. Good. The car is feeling great. Really? You sucked. Tire wear. Literally, you just wrecked the tires. Wrecked the car. Okay then. Uh, perhaps not a great driver to get. I don't know. Perhaps his tire. I don't actually see his tire wear to be honest. I don't. I don't actually know what happened. Stonebridge Speedsters have produced some brand new brakes. Ooh. Okay, that's worrying. That's, that is a worry. So they both got a point. We're going to work on um, tire wear, as you can probably predict. 
Uh, we got, barring income, around 800,000. Not bad, not bad. Uh, next card development has been unlocked. Ooh. Okay, so we want to work on... What do we want to work on? So you got fuel efficiency. So that's tire wear um, and fuel efficiency. So I can go for power, which is all about parts receive larger performance bonuses. The, the chassis, which is about fuel efficiency and tire wear, which obviously, as we know, is pretty important. Next year's car um, can be more complex, so you get more car bonus tokens. I'll go for the chassis. That seems like the most advisable option, I think. Uh, right, so can we put more into this? Next year's car. What's this? Uh, the more money you plough into R&D, the better your car will be next year. I don't know what formula I'm going to be in, so I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> so I can put loads of money into it. Okay, so one million. Confirm investment. Might be worth it. I don't know. A million's a lot of money, isn't it? Okay, we do one million. Thank God for that financial backstory. We saved 50,000. Great. All right, up the R&D budget. So let's work on getting a new engineer. One that's really good with reliability. Aha, Nicole, I like the look of you. I do like the look of you. That is pretty, pretty good. Here's 39. Race day performance is only four. Leadership specialist, specialist with the the rear wing. Leadership minus five, which is kind of annoying. Um, we can use our influence to look at another potential engineer. So I'm gonna use it. My first ever influence will be based off this. I want the best engineer I can get. New achievement. Uh, who is this new engineer then? Is it this person? Ah, not particularly what I want right now. Yeah, I really want reliability. I'm gonna go for Nicole. Yeah. So I'm gonna get rid of uh, Jensen. I think. Yeah. I think that's the right option. There we go. Because reliability is just not. It's just not good enough. So Nicole's gonna work on reliability. Uh, Lee will work on reliability as well, and Jones will work on performance. There we go. That's some good breaks. Build the parts. That should hopefully be ready for the next race. We're quite a lot of money right now. <laughs> I've just noticed that. Whoops. Uh, that will do for now. Actually, I believe both drivers have points to spend. So let's spend those points. So what's his tire wear like? Smoothness. Four. Okay, that's the issue. He's not very smooth at all. And he's very bad at braking. He's a pretty bad driver. <laughs> he's got potential though, so hopefully he will grow. Ah, of course. McKenna's got a point as well. To spend. Uh, reached potential with smoothness. Um, let's go with... Ooh. Focus. I don't want to crash. <laughs> pretty please. Right, there we go. I think we're ready for, is this Milan? Is that the next race? Yes. Dilemma, what's this? It's all fake news. Fake news, it's, it's fake news. Who says that? Um, anyway, uh, Scott, an ex-employee is spreading lies to the press. It's all untrue, of course. Rest assured, if anything was wrong, it would be the fault of my predecessor. So the person that was in charge of the team before me. Either way, I'd appreciate it if you declined any interviews. Ooh, you get influence or money. I could do with money right now, to be honest. There we go. I feel really bad, but this is business. I need money for my car, okay? That is worth doing. <laughs> Sweet. Scott Garman has refused to comment. He has. So what is next? They did say something about some like, weekend that was special. Oh, Invitational, what's that? I don't know what this is. I've got no idea. 
Uh, let's find out. New invitational event. Ah, so we have the option between a jewel in the desert or an endurance race. Okay. Um, let's go for a jewel in the desert. Sounds fun. So do I take control of this GT team? What? I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this. I don't know what I'm doing. So back in the uh, bar ring. We just come from here, but we've gone back. This is a one-off invitational event. Hopefully Team Russia can stick it on the pole today. So we've got qualifying first. Uh, let's start qualifying. Um, send out. So these are completely just random drivers. I don't know what they're good at or what they do. Uh, let's go for 16%. This is a risk. There is seven. It is a risk. It was a disaster. Great. Uh, go out on the medium tyre. Send that Williams. You have 13 spanners. Let's go for 12%. Just a camber, which took away four spanners. Let's go for the max one again. Just keep trying to get that increase. Slowly increase with time. Um, again, 5%. Optimise the initial gear. Uh, we've got 0 to 2 there. This is some good increases. Ready to go. Send out on the medium tyre. That was a good little uh, set of upgrades. Right, so they're both out. Let's fast forward time. This doesn't really... I mean, I guess it's good to have the bonus money. I was at like 1.5 million. So that's pretty decent. Didn't mind that. We could put that into next year's car. I'm not even sure what formula we're doing in the next year's car. I don't know. I've got no idea. Right, so purple sector, purple sector. Williams is a very good driver, apparently. So he is. Oh no, he's not. <laughs> he's now fourth. Damn! This could be tricky to win. Uh, we're slowly dropping down the order. Oh, great. I've got no chance of winning this, have I? Right, pause it. Trying to send them out again. Right, let's see what we can do here. Uh, between 0 and 5. So we've got 0. How good would that be? Between 0 and... Between 1 and 4. Yeah. So that was 2. Do I risk it? Mm, risking it. Please don't. Damn it. That was a big risk. I, need to, I had to do it though. I had to do it. I had to give it a go. Uh, let's go to... So go back. We do have some spanners available. Go for that. Adjust the stiffness. Between 1 and 10. But 14%. 6. Okay, that's good. Uh, instead of risking it, I will let you go back out. Yes. Continue. 59%! You have the car. You have the car to go out and really smash it. Smash that qualifying lap. It's actually very, very tight. Very tight. Only half a second in it. So we can just improve our time. I'm very close on that, I just realised. They're like against each other. Purple first sector for Williams. Green sector. He is second. That's a lot better. Not bad at all. Uh, we got second and 20th. That's completely the opposite. Um, I don't think I have time to go back out. No, that's it. That's the end of the, uh, the qualifying. So we got second and 20th. Uh, oops. <laughs> that's all I can say, really. Oops. Oh, down to fourth. Damn it. No, nope, down to seventh. What the hell? The track got really good at the end. Oh, that sucks. It really sucks. It's going to be hard to win this, but it's a, it's a one-off event. I'm giving it a go. That's all I can do, really. I imagine overtaking will be difficult. If you're in the same car as your competitor, it's going to be very tricky. All right, let's go through this. I mean, this isn't exactly my team. This is like an invitational event. Uh, topping up on the refuel the fueling. So refueling is in this mode for the first time. Um, let's make sure. So you can go like heavy on the on the car. You can just go like extreme. But you got to keep it in fueling. It's all up to you. Really got to balance it out. What's this? So fuel burns four percent slower. 
Um, all pit stops are minus one second faster. Park condition fix. Oh, we can only pick one actually, so let's go for fuel on that. Uh, let's go for super hard with you. Uh, continue. Uh, can I max it out to 12 laps? Yep. Uh, we're going to go for. We go for a medium setup. I don't know what to do here. I want to try and do one pit stop with both, which could be uh, interesting. I mean, that might be how we win this race. So we're going to go for both on super hards. This is a big risk. I don't know if it's going to work, but I'm going to give it a go. They're both on. They can push at the start, uh, which is going to be important. Let's see if Williams um, can make up any places. I don't think he will be able to, but we'll see. Up to six, down to seven. <laughs> He briefly got 6th place. Uh, down to 8th. Oh god, this could be tricky. Come on, Williams. Come on, Williams. Up to 7th. Nope, down to 8th. 7th, 8th. Down up to 6th. Interesting. Interesting. I'm now going to turn down to neutral. Because these tyres have got to try and last. If we can hold them on. So slightly later on into the race. That would be great. Pretty please. Williams is still eight. Uh, Williams, you want to go down to neutral on the fuel. The start is pretty important. We're only eighth, though. So really got to try and move a bit forward. But I guess if, if, everyone, if everyone pits two times, which I reckon is the case, that might be our chance to win it. That's our only chance to win it. So we will see. Let's fast forward time um, to see what happens. I don't, don't really much I can do at the moment. Uh, Williams. Yeah, keep going. Keep pushing with the fuel. That's my only way to really push forward and try and keep up. Oops, someone has been eliminated. Williams down to ninth. Ah, it's annoying. Let's bring him up to medium or down to medium. Both cars seem in pretty good condition. Williams up to fifth, up, down to sixth. I think a few might be pitting now. This could be interesting. This could be, this could be a very tactical race. I don't think I have the drivers to win. Williams now first. Okay. What do I do here? Interesting. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um... Still got a number of laps left. This is a tricky race to uh, judge. I don't have much experience with this formula, so I'm trying to take it all in. But we are in first place. I'm hoping it's only pit once with Williams. The car's in still pretty good nick. 11 laps left. When do we pit Williams? Right, so we're going to bring Brody in because his tyres are slightly worse. We're going to switch him to the Super Hards. And we're going to have, yeah, 10 laps of fuel. Let's bring him in. And then Williams, who is my main contender for the race right now, he will have to go round again, which is a worry. Is a bit of a worry. And he's a bit low on fuel. Hopefully he's got enough. Oh, dilemma. Um, we'll be out of fuel. We should be able to, we have to go around for the next lap. Go to low. Right, so Williams has gone round. Um, you can now pit. Um, so, I reckon you can probably manage the hard tyre. And enough fuel. Yes. Let's see how this goes. Yeah. Can you get around? Should be alright. Yeah, you can get around, surely. New tyres. Yeah, just about enough fuel. Oh man, the tyres are about to burn out there. 1% for Williams. Jesus! Where will Williams come out? So he's going to go onto the hard side. He's just down to second place. He comes third. Oh, third's actually pitted as well. Williams could win this race. Interesting. Very interesting. He's got just about enough fuel. Uh, let's go attack on these tyres for a little bit. Actually, is that wires? No. Go neutral. You can attack Brody. So why is he 8th? How is he 8th? How has he got into 8th place? Attack Brody, go! Why won't he? There we go. Clear's working. Williams is 2nd. Just about holding on. On the hard tyre. 
we have, if I'm correct, we have six laps left. So Williams has got a lead of two seconds and he's slowly edging that out actually. This might be a perfectly performed strategy. And they're not crashing, which I guess is a plus. Ah, so the person in last place gets eliminated. Okay. I'm surprised Brody is still in this. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Excess fuel. Just got to keep going. Just keep holding on to that. If Brody can somehow slip into second, it might be a risk though. Just pushing those tyres. It's quite a big gap though, isn't it? It's quite a big gap. Yeah, definitely got excess fuel. Whoops. So I'm going to let him push that car. Oh, he's down to fourth. Can he slip up back in? Oh, he's back into third. Come on, Brody. You can do it. Oh, can he get into second place? That would be absolutely incredible if he can. He's in second place. We get first and second. No. No, no, no. This can't be possible. Wow. We came first and second. Brody started in 20th place, I think. Or 19th or something like that. Wow. What a race. I don't know how we did that, but well done to the drivers, well done to the team. Well done to me. I will yep, yeah, I'm gonna say that, I don't care what you say. That was a good race. Tactical genius. Don't know how we did that. First and second. I deserve more than 1.5 million. Absolute quality. So we got 1.7 actually. Very good. How cool was that? No, Greece, what happened? I'll tell you what, what happened. Didn't have me as a principal. Cough up. I'll get you that win. So I didn't realize until like later on, if you're in last place, you get eliminated. Oh, woo. That is decent. 1.6 million. Oh, yes. So we can work on perhaps getting like another part. I mean, we've already got a part for the brakes. This should be a lot more reliable as well. So this will go on to Bart's car. So not a massive bonus, but look at that reliability. That is so much better. And performance also has gone up. So I can't complain at all. And um, what we can do is we can swap that out. So it's got better performance, but slightly less, sorry, reliability. I can't speak English. Uh, a sign part. Oh yeah, new brakes. Oh yeah. 66% reliability. Probably need a new front wing now. To try and bring that up a little bit more. Collect. Claim bonus. I would like a uh, tire wear. So my tire wear has gone up apparently. Is that on the car? I don't know how that works. Contract is about to expire. Uh, Peter Johnston, I would like to keep you. So I will renew that contract. There we go. A slight little nudge there. 10,000, that's completely fine. Uh, let's build a new part. Let's build a new front wing. So again, reliability, reliability, and then big fat performance. Yeah. yeah it's a lot of money, but it's worth it, I think. Yes. Uh, Scott Holman, we've just started the new design. Should be finished in a couple of weeks. So that's the design, I believe, for the new car. Uh, I'm also going to go to headquarters. And I'm going to work on suspension, I think. Yeah, suspension. 1.5 million. Ouch. But we just won that from the bonus. So it's an investment into the team. I feel like we need it for the next tier as well. So the next episode might be quite a long one. We're going to do two races. Round four and five. And we'll work out what we do after. If we do win, fingers crossed, we win uh, the constructors, we can then move on to the next tier. So exciting times. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys soon. And bye-bye.